Hello everyone and welcome back to another Plan With Me video. Today we are working in the horizontal happy planner that I use as my academic planner and we are just going to jump right into it. We are planning for the week of October 12th through the 18th. So let's take these pages out and put that off to the side. And the horizontal planner has a color scheme laid out for us already. Oh wait, I took out two sheets of this one. Let me put this one back in. Okay, so like I was saying, the horizontal planner has a color scheme laid out for us already. It is blue, um, blue for the lines here and purple down the spine and purple in the square. But this week I'm going to try to change up this color scheme with washi tape. So I have this orange washi tape that I'm going to put over the blue. So we are going to change it to orange and I'm going to try to find a sticker to put over in this square. So we are going to do that. I can still see the blue underneath it. I could go through and white out all of the lines, but I think that would be a little bit much. So yeah, I don't know. I'll make it closer so you can see once I'm done with this one. So like how you can see the blue underneath, that doesn't bother me too much. So I'm just going to leave it as is and continue on. Okay, now we have the washi tape covering um, all of the blue. And next we have to get out our sticker book. So I'm going to use the older version. No, I'm going to use the newer version of the fall sticker book by the Happy Planner. So we're going to use this one. And there are a few stickers I'm going to get from this American Crafts sticker book. So the first thing we are going to do is find a square to put over this um, sticker in the bottom. And I'm actually going to use the old fall sticker book for that because I remember seeing, yeah, this one. We're going to put this sticker right here. Over it like that. And that looks super cute. That looks nice. And then we are just going to pick some random stickers like I always do in the horizontal spread. The horizontal spread is still a little bit challenging for me to decorate for. So I'm just going to choose stickers that hopefully go together. Like we're going to first start with this sticker. We're going to put it in the corner here. Then we have, let's see, this little tree. We could put this somewhere. put it down here or I could put it down I'll put it down here over here in the notes area we have Let's see. Actually, I'm going to move this because I just see I have this sticker that says notes. So I'm going to move the tree
I think I will put it here in the corner. And then we're going to put a little bit of white out over where it says notes. And then we're going to put this sticker over it. Then we have, I think that's all we're going to get from this sticker book. So then we're going to go to this sticker book and probably use some of these leaves. But let's just take a quick look through and see what kind of stickers we have to work with. Let's use these ones that say remember. Let's use this one on Monday. Let's use this one on Wednesday. are cute. Let's use this one. And use this one on Thursday. We have another one we could use on Friday. And then we have the weekend. I'm going to leave that one open for now. Let's see. Let's use this quote. It says, but I love fall most of all. We're going to use this on Saturday. It might spill into Sunday a little bit. We're going to use this one that says Autumn Vibes. Let's use this for Monday. I'm going to use this one. Down here in this corner. And let's see, I need to leave a lot of space to write in this planner for every day. So I'm just probably going to put down a few more stickers. Let's see. A lot of these are Halloween stickers, so they're not really going to work. Let's. Well, let's see. You know what I'm gonna do? Cause I need something here on Sunday. I'm gonna use more washi tape, put it along here just so it could take up some of this space that we have. And then I feel like this is really sticker heavy. So I'm actually going to use this washi tape at the top here. Let's see how that looks. That looks a little bit weird, but I'm going to go with it because if I'm leaving these spaces blank, I need something to go around the page at least. So we have that. I'm going to use this um, 
pumpkin washi tape at the very bottom here. Let's lift up the sticker. And then we're going to put it here. And then we're just going to start sticking down some of these leaves that are on here. Let's see, we have one small sticker. Let's put it down there. And I think this one is done. No, we need something on this side. There, now we're done. Cause I don't really write on Sunday. So that's why I need stuff to take up space at the bottom or else it like once all the writing is in it'll look super plain so we have all of that let's you know what i forgot to do in my horizontal planner is plan out my exams and things to study for i guess i'm gonna have to do that afterward and hope that i find stickers to match that go along with it when I write everything in. I can't believe I forgot to do that. But let's just put this in our planner, take one final look, and I think that looks super cute. I love the fact that I changed the blue because I had blue for the past two weeks and I'm really glad that I used the washi tape. I actually got this idea from a comment I got on a video recently when I was talking about um, how the horizontal planner has a color scheme already for us. And I got a comment that mentioned that I could use washi tape to change the color scheme. And I'm so glad that I did because this turned out so well. I'm so happy with the autumn vibes that it gives off. I'm glad that I use multiple washi tapes and the stickers are super cute. It leaves a lot of room to write for each of the days. And that is it. That's all I have for you today. Thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.